Oh boy. Well, I'm glad we got the bad trailer out the way. Now let's talk about that Deadpool teaser. Hey guys, Keon back here, and now that I finished talking about the Rampage trailer, now I really gotta talk about that Deadpool teaser. Which I know a lot of people have seen, and it's really good guys, even though it's a teaser. It's just a funny, at the beginning of it, you can honestly skip the beginning of the trailer if you want to. It's just some funny little simple Deadpool humor that you expect. It's a parody of Bob Ross, those of you that don't know Bob Ross, he was this dude back I guess like in the 90s or something. I've seen like, get, like one episode before where he just does paintings just to teach how to paint a couple times. But the thing that's funny about Deadpool doing it is that some of the paintings are named after either actors or movies. And it's just like one was called Betty White for just regular white. And then after he's done with all these doing the paintings, the paintings are just shifting one after the other. He's not even fully painting anything. And then it's just the last one that surprises him. He just drops it. That was actually kind of funny to me personally. But the thing that was really good about this trailer was, of course, the scenes that we we're getting in Deadpool 2. And the thing about these, the scenes that we were seeing in that, it seems like Deadpool is still going to be grounded, which is why it's Deadpool 1 was so successful. And I'm glad the fact that they're still making it grounded. I really do wonder where Cable fits in this whole thing as well. Um, I actually want to know where other characters are going to be doing now. I mean, I see that we see Negasonic Teenage Warhead in this as well again. And... Sporting a new hairstyle, I mean, she looks great. And I love the fact she has the S-Man outfit. I wonder if we're gonna see other S-Man characters. I know Colossus will still be in here, but I just wanna know if we're gonna see other mutants as well. Kinda doubt it, but hey, just, you know, wishful thinking. I wonder who was that fat person that was inside of some church-like area with fire around them. And see that like we're gonna even see one returning character, which was the taxi driver, I forgot his name, but he was in Deadpool 1, and many people did like him, cause he did stuff, I guess. But you seem like you're going to see more of him. really am excited to see what's going on. Also, you want to know what the hell that whole scene with Deadpool hitting the car. Really has my attention, of course. You know, it's Deadpool 2. Who wouldn't really want to see that? It's coming out next year. So, you know, we have a lot of good movies coming out next year, uh, Marvel-wise. Can't really say much about this teaser that went pretty fast. There's a lot. Of, there's only a good amount of things that they showed you. But in all, guys, this, trailer, this teaser trailer was pretty good. I do recommend that you go check it out. I'll even try and put a description below for it. And as well, if there's any movies, animes, trailers, or anything else that you guys want me to talk about, just always comment below. If you've seen the trailer, what did you think of it? Do you think it was good? Do you think Deadpool's movie's going to be bad? Do you think it has potential? And, hey, would you want to make a Deadpool 3? Just comment below. And as always, don't fail to ring that bell. Like if you dare. Subscribe if you care. And Kim for Miles. Star, I'm burning out fast. I try to shine, but it's never gonna last.